Okay, so we decided to make it a little larger. That's just the way things go. They say an eco-friendly house can't be built in 150 days for $150,000, and I say it can. I'm Alan Smith. Join me as I push the limits with time, budget, and creativity with the Garden Home Challenge, exclusively on eHow Home. What a glorious day. Just the kind of day you would want to spend out on a big porch like this. Well, the porch has gotten larger. Um, it was only eight feet from the house to this point. And um, this finished floor material I'll pull back, you can see we added another four feet onto the, the deck to give it, well, just more room. And the reason this porch feels so much smaller than the front porch, because they're essentially the same size, the front porch is a little longer. The chimney actually interrupts this space quite a bit and uh, makes it feel much smaller. So the plan here is to come out to this point here with some posts and we'll have a covered porch and then from here out it will be uncovered but there'll be a rail there. Now take a look at the floor joists. Tony has put these together with 2 by 12 material so it's really solid and it's supported by our concrete block pillars. So the finished floor material is, is this. It's a, really a one inch thick board that has a rounded edge on either side here and here and um, it's six inches wide. These boards are 16 feet long. So um, you can buy them that length and these will be placed side by side. There's still quite a bit of moisture in these. So he's gonna pack them in really close together, one against the other. And then as they dry, you'll get about a quarter inch gap between these. But if you put a gap between them starting out and then they shrunk, you're gonna have a much wider gap. So what's really good about this material is it'll last a long time. There's a 40 year warranty on this, this treated wood. And um, you know, it's gonna age really beautifully. You, we don't have to put any sort of um, protectant on it or finish. I could paint it if I want, but the idea here is just for it to become sun bleached and kind of gray colored so it'll blend in with the surroundings, the woods and so forth. So it's really amazing what four feet has added to this, this space. I'm glad I made this decision to make this a little more spacious. If you're enjoying following what we're doing here at the house, make sure you subscribe to eHow Home.